What up, y'all? It's your boy Juggle972 back here. And to the Velt we go. We just recruited uh, Cyan. So, yes. But now, since we're going to the Velt, we need a party of three. Just a party of three. No, nothing more. Because if we're going to get them, we need an open spot. Let's see. I believe the Velt is... Yes right here now we're gonna want to land here because oh there goes that classic music now we just gotta run into old gal or young gal if you will okay there we go take care of these easy monsters real quick get them out of the way Would you look at that? <laughs> How's it going? I'm your friend. Let's travel together. Sure, let's travel together. Okay. Gonna need to go through this large cave real quick. Cave in the belt. Okay. Oh, did you hear that? Interceptor! You're coming with us. Okay. Okay, follow that dog. Ooh, there's a treasure chest there. Alrighty. A rage ring. Okay. Well, what's this? Alrighty, let's go talk to this group here. We three recently went hunting in the belt. Saw some weird kid dressed up in all hides. Reduce the number of people in your party if you wanted to approach you. In the forest north of the belt dwells a frightful dragon. I suppose no human could ever defeat it, but... Oh, how free would be if somebody would. For some reason, he never came to off. Well, he's here now. So, there's a dragon here. Alrighty. What's this? Ooh, monster in a box. Aloe Ver. Okay. Oh, gee, how novel. Now get on up. I believe he is undead, right? Let me see if an X-Potion will do him in. Okay. Yep. Just like I figured. Ooh, and Tiger Fangs. Awesome. Saban's gonna have a badass repertoire. And I believe the Tiger Fangs are his ultimate weapon, too. Hell yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's tread south. Alrighty. Alright. These fucking encounters. What do we got here? Alrighty. Let's keep going. Shadow! Here we go. Oh, save point. Yes, I remember what happens here. Okay. Since we found our friend Shadow, who is alive, by the way. Spoiler alert. But there's a vengeful spirit, or just a vengeful beast in general, that is actually around. Not to mention, if you kill him, well... Let me prep real quick. Let's see. We're gonna give a uh, zone seek to Gal. And you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and give. You know what? 
We're good without it. Yep, we found Shadow. Ruff, ruff. Look at those wounds. Alrighty. The Great Behemoth. Or the Senior Behemoth, as it's uh, so aptly called. We're going to start off by casting Zone Seek. By raising our magic defenses. We're going to start drilling. And we're going to have Celis cast Runic. Because this Behemoth is a magic user. A very, very, very potent one, nonetheless. Now, at this point, though, it's got 19,000 HP. So what we're going to do... Oh, good lord. Damn it, Celis. You fucked up. Okay, hang on. Now, I don't use Gal very much, but I probably should start using him a little more. Oh, yeah, and then there's that. Every time Celis uses that. Okay, come on. Now, it doesn't have a lot of HP. Only 19,000. But, it won't be so easy afterwards. Not if you're necessarily prepared, you know, with good healing magic, too. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, let's kill him first. Just rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat. That's all it is. God damn it, Celis, why do you fail me? Alright, hang on. We're gonna haste everybody. Celis, you're responsible for healing at this, po at this point. Alrighty. Now everybody's fast. Alrighty. Oh yeah, and there's that too. Meteor. Very, very high damaging meteor. Alrighty. Enemies coming from behind. Another monster appeared. No, it's not another monster. That is the Great Behemoth, undead. What do you do about the undead? You give them life. You give them life, they die. You know, growing up though, as a kid, I never knew this. I always fought him. The Behemoth King is down. Gowler and Rasp. Got a behemoth suit. Oh, and a Thunderblade. I can't do anything from here. Take him back to the airship using. Oh, to Thamasa? Thamasa, here we go. This lovely little cutscene, if you want to call it that. It appears that Thamasa has some land around it. Let's make him rest. Poor Interceptor. You were having a nightmare. came to fetch me, but I won't be coming back. I want you and the girl to live in a peaceful world. That wouldn't happen to be Shadow, right? Would it not? That appears to be the case. Let's rest here for a moment. Are you okay? No need to worry. It's just a scratch. Also, he's gonna stand guard. So you just relax. That's a good dog right there. Man's best friend. Something. I saw a monster floating in the sky. 
Looks just like a fish. Now, will we go back to Thamasa? If you're looking for the man that dressed all in black, he left for the Coliseum. So, Dragon's Net Coliseum it is. Whoa! That is Doom Gaze, everybody! Okay, if you remember playing Final Fantasy VII, it was just like running into uh, Ultimate Weapon. This enemy right here has about 500, like 550, uh, 55,555 uh, HP. 55555. Now, Doom Gaze will run away if you hit him hard enough, or if you do enough damage to him. So, right now, do as much damage as you can to him, and hurt him. Hurt him hard. Gonna keep drilling. Now, it's not very likely that you see him right afterwards, but the more you fly around after, after landing and getting back up, yeah, this is the best you'll get to him. But, I will say this, he has one of the best rewards in the game. That reward is none other than a, a match site, an Esper. An Esper that he holds. A very, very good Esper. Oh, and there he goes. Now, worry not. You can run into him again. Okay. We have found the Coliseum. Dragon Neck Coliseum. Look, Coliseum. <gasps> Whoa! Everybody's favorite octopus. <laughs> Look at me. I'm a receptionist. <laughs> now you better watch out or Master Ch well, Typhoon will come and take it from you. This is Dragon's Net Coliseum. Champions from all over the world come here to fight for prizes. The only bad part about fighting in the Coliseum, everything is AI controlled. The more prestigious the item wagered, the better your prize will be. I'm an Imperial Trooper. Probably the last of them. If you have some value for it, oh, talk to the Emperor twice. Use this when you found the place where the Emperor hid the secret treasure. Battles in the Coliseum are one on one. Well, no shit. Someone's been pretending to be me, so don't be fooled. Wait. You're the real Siegfried. Huh, that'll explain the weakened Zieg uh, Siegfried that I've come across in the past. Well, let's take a look over here. This is my... Yep. Finally, the whole world is at war. Yeah, you're, you're a sick bastard, you know that? There's some guy here who's all dressed in black. He's looking for a blade called the Striker? Get a load of the crowds! Okay, so we can't come back unless we have the Striker knife. So we're gonna go search for that soon. Alright, everybody. I've got the Striker. Yes. We'll fight. With pleasure. Now, we shall bet the Striker. Yep. Shadow it is. I'm going to give it to Saban to fight. All you got to do is just beat Shadow. Now, this is all AI controlled. So, it's all up to the computer to actually do something right. For some reason, the AI decides to use uh, poison for some reason. I can't, you know, see the logic in that. Just attack. Simple as that. Got the striker. The only thing I know how to do is fight. Why not come with us? Why not come with us? Well, first I need to see how far as I can get here. Alrighty. The ninja has joined us. Now we can end the episode. I'll see you then. Much love. 
and peace.